making his way to the ring from San Luis Potosi, Mexico, weighing in at 239 pounds, Alberto Del Rio. Ladies and gentlemen, Alberto Del Rio likes to fancy himself as Mexico's greatest export. Yeah, I'm sure. But I'm willing to bet nobody in Mexico was sad to see him go. Big match for him here tonight. like we're about to see in this one. The awesome one is in for a fight tonight. He's going to need the figure four leg lock and the skull crushing finale. I'm interested to see what happens here with all three competitors in the ring. Will we see an alliance form? We got a triple threat match, but I'm a triple threat all by myself. Handsome, smart, a nose for business. Well, all that being said, these Miami fans have left South Beach and are sending the Richter scale north with every cheer, every stomp and scream. King, you've had countless classics in that ring, including a phenomenal TLC match against The Miz himself in 2010. What can you share with us about the awesome one? I can't think of too many superstars that the WWE Universe loves to hate more than this guy. This is a great opportunity to make a statement. Coming out on top of these two will do wonders for a career. I like to compare The Miz to a bit of Luthez, Harley Race, and even Shawn Michaels. I mean, all three of them combined into one super B. And I like to tell you that you have no idea what you're talking about. Thank you. 
And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Neville not in a good spot here. But things can change in an instant in a triple threat match. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Well, it's hard to argue that. But I'd say this one could go either way. And what a reversal from Alberto Del Rio. If he keeps up this pace, this can turn real ugly real fast. He doesn't want to do this outside. It's safe to say the entire WWE locker room has just been put on notice. Whoa, man! Well, he was able to reverse it and get out of that. Here we go. Alberto Del Rio setting it up. Oh, my! There's the submission hold. He's in the driver's seat now. to do now. He's starting to feel the pressure of this triple threat match, guys. Well, these guys have been so tightly matched up until now, but this might be where that finally starts to change. Well, if there's one thing that I've learned from sitting here at ringside all these years, it's that you can never count a gamer out. And this guy, he's a gamer. Alberto Del Rio, no problem getting out of that one. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Neville. Oh, look at the Miz. He just got nailed. Yeah, the awesome one's got to be injured here. That was brutal. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? He looks a bit off his game here, but he's not appearing too worse for wear, at least not yet anyway. Hey, when it comes to the guy's finisher, he's of the belief if at first you don't succeed, oh my, Neville. Okay, he stumbled a bit, but he's all right. Nothing big. Miz is in trouble. What does the Miz have to do at this point to stay in this match? This may very well be one of his tough... Hey, this may very well be it. Uh, he's not done fighting yet. I don't know where he's finding the strength to stay in this one. The quick reversal there by Neville. He is slowly getting dissected. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. The end may be near. Oh my gosh! Now that's a finishing move. This thing might be all over. You gotta be kidding me. What should Alberto Del Rio try to do differently at this stage to remain viable? Man, there's no getting up from that. Man, this is brutal. He needs to reorganize his thoughts after that one. The Miz with a nice reversal. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. Will this be it? I think he's got it. is looking to fly. This guy's just getting worn out. Watch out! He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. When this guy's on, look out. Del Rio gets out of the way of that one. That was a pretty sharp move. Oh, Neville may have it. Neville! 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 Uh-oh, there's the finisher. This might be over, and I mean all over. I think he has to find a way to rally here and fast. With this kind of attack, you have to wonder just how much longer they can compete in this match. Yeah, I completely agree. The way things are going in there, I'd say not much longer. My gosh, this is a beating. A win here in this triple threat match can go a long way in solidifying yourself as a serious threat to the rest of the locker room. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh, this may very well end it. Oh, my. The Miz. The finish.
Punisher strikes again. There's the cover. Can he do it? I think he's got it. of Survivor Series. stopping nothing to retain the gold. And we're about to learn that right here. As a reminder, folks, the champion will be putting the gold on the line in this one. here. The refs warned them. And there's the bell. And here we go. 
This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. Oh, this one's gonna be good. One of these guys is about to leave with the gold. Which one will it be? We're gonna find out right now. Can't wait to see how this thing unfolds. Well, guys, I know one thing. This crowd is ready to see what Cesaro can do here tonight. Since it's not a false count anywhere match, I'd have to agree with you. Now back to the ring. Back into the ring now. The challenger's taking on some offense. But he certainly comes into this championship match with a ton of momentum. I tell you, we knew this was going to be a close affair, but I don't think we expected it to be this tight. What a match. And on top of that, John, these two guys couldn't be any more evenly matched at this point. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. This could end it in a hurry. Really pushing his opponent to the... What a move. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. I don't like how slow he is to react right now. Rolling out of the ring, hoping to escape here. Yeah, you may have to go all the way to the back to escape. He doesn't want to win this one outside the ring. Because he's a pro king, he wants to get it done inside. Hmm. The champ counters, and you see the result. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. It's over. That's got to be it. What a finishing move. This could be it right here. That phased him. I mean, the and his shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. After the amount of punishment he suffered, it's simply amazing that he's still in this one. We got a cover. Looking at it here. I think this is it. One, two. Oh, this guy's a competitor. He's not going down yet. Yeah, not without a fight anyway. I don't know where he's finding the strength to stay in this one. Reversal. Cesaro showing his prowess. He missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The breeze may give him a cold. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. The challenger looking absolutely exhausted in there. He put up a good fight, but it may be the end of the line for the... Oh, nice counter. The champ. Just one step quicker. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Oh, this isn't good. What a move. This is in for the pin and the win. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. Uh-oh, big move coming. He's looking to put his up. Thanks for coming. Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This might be it. Hot damn, it's exciting. Wow, man, look at that. And we see it one more time. Could this be it? I think so. Two, three. It's all over. That's the final elimination.
Tag Team Contest is an elimination tag team match. Introducing first, from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks. This match has chaos written all over it. That's what I love about it. I love chaos. With these six competitors in the ring, this one's gonna be beyond thrilling. Last kicker, Becky Lynch. Uh, I don't know many divas on the roster more ready to break out than this one. She comes, the young woman that many people believe will be the future of the Divas division, Paige. The future and the present, Cole. Paige isn't standing idly by waiting for her turn. She's taking it. Truthfully, I'm good with any Survivor Series match that doesn't include four doinks. <laughs> what was that all about anyway? Wasn't one doink enough? from the start of this six-man tag match. Let's don't wait any longer, let's get it going. This promises to be one of the most exciting matches in recent Survivor Series history. Jewel, Charlotte, makes her way to the ring. Wow, she looks great tonight. Two battle-tested teams of three set to go at it here tonight.
This is going to be nothing short of chaos. We're just moments out from our six-man tag match. Who doesn't love chaos, Cole? Six-man tag team action coming up. Oh, this is going to be great. And here we go with this three-on-three -three tag team matchup. Uh -huh, bring on the fireworks because this WWE party has officially begun. Both these teams have skilled superstars on their side, so it's anybody's guess who will get the best of this three-on-three -three match. And no matter what, these are the types of nights they'll write about in the WWE annals for years to come. What does Sasha Banks need to do to win tonight? It's not every night that she's looking at this kind of competition in there. What would your strategy be in a match like this? Well, I've seen competitors get lost in the shovel with all that talent in the ring at the same time, but I don't think we have to worry about that here. Plenty of confidence being shown right now. Uh, this is special. Here we have six of perhaps sports entertainment's most revered individuals in the same ring. some offense here. Nothing she can't fire back from, though. Don't discount her, Michael. She is absolutely one of the most dangerous divas around today. I don't know about you guys, but the way I see it, it's just a little too early to get overly concerned for her right here. between the ropes. You just knew a match of this caliber was gonna spill out on the floor eventually. I mean, when you put these two competitors together, anything's gonna happen.
absorbing some offense here. By no means is this dire straits for her, though. Keep in mind, though, neither one of these divas has shown signs of pulling away. What a close match. Agreed. And these women have been pretty evenly matched thus far. by Emma. She's starting to sweat a bit. She doesn't appear too concerned, however. You said it, Michael. And these Divas have given us an incredibly even match contest up to this point. Well, I can't argue that point, John. And neither one of these women has really taken control of this match. Look at this hang time. Incredible. I mean, that's how you pick your moment and go for it. Escape by Paige. Paige's quickness continues to impress me. Emma's starting to sweat. When she agreed to this match, she knew this wasn't going to be easy. Let me in. Paige looking to end this quickly. Two. Emma's been eliminated. Michael. It's so sad. Yeah, cut off at the last second. Back in the ring now. And a quick pen attempt by Asuka. the tag Becky Lynch into the ring great reversal oh Becky Lynch going in she's absorbing some offense here this is not how she drew this one up <laughs> look at these divas go neither one of them are backing down yeah but it's been a pretty even back and forth battle up until now and Becky's able to get out of the way uh, she was lucky there Peggy Lynch is just too fast there. She is quick. Man, she's making it look easy here. Oscar is just too fast there. She is quick.
Oscar scores with a tremendous move. Somebody's gonna get hurt in this match. And she goes for the quick pin. Uh oh, big move coming. Uh oh, Oscar is looking to end it. strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. And it's Becky Lynch executing the reversal. Oh, did she take a shot there? Slowly back to her feet. We got a cover. there. Things have gotten worse for Becky Lynch. This six-man match may have taken it all out of her. Yeah, and when she goes back and watches this, she's going to point to this portion of the match and wonder what the heck she was thinking. You said it. But I'll never count her out until the final bell. She's just so resilient. to see how these teams interact. There are so many unique personalities and oftentimes they don't necessarily mesh well. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Well, that's it. And from where I'm sitting, she needs to regroup right away. You don't want to get in this diva's way. from Sasha Banks. Looks like Paige is in a bit of trouble. Her hopes of winning this match may very well be in jeopardy. Hey, she came to this match knowing it wasn't going to be Tiddly Winks. Yeah, but look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. Some damage has been dished out, but certainly not enough to assume this one's even close to being over. Charlotte reverses it. Looks to me like the gas tank is at about halfway. You want to make sure it doesn't get close enough to E, though. That's for sure. It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time. And here's Asuka, in up the tag. Every time she has to get back to her feet, it takes more and more effort. What a wild attempt at striking your opponent. I don't know if she could have been further off the mark. 
<laughs> that was like a haymaker. Like she was taking that big home run swing. Six of WWE's most alpha personalities all competing in the same match. There's a good chance this one ends deteriorating sooner than later. We're looking at complete domination here. Oh, look at the emotion. I'm not sure if she knows what planet she's on after that. Here comes Paige. Paige hit that one. Oh, there it is. What a maneuver. That's can she end it here? Maybe. Slowly back to her feet. Asuka turns it around. And it's Asuka that sees it coming. And Paige finds a way out. Look at Paige making her moves. This is one of those matches you just like to sit back and enjoy watching. Yeah, one of those you never want to see in. The switch here to Charlotte. What an all-star ensemble in the ring right now. Six of WWE's most successful competitors for sure. She's utilized her finisher twice up to this point, and neither time was it enough to put her opponent away. Could this be it? I think so. I think that's it. It's an elimination. Six of WWE's most the personalities all competing in the same match. There's a good chance this one ends deteriorating sooner than later. Can she keep her down? Maybe. A minor miracle might be needed to overcome this beating.
Sasha Banks is not looking good here. Oh, Sasha Banks won't be able to withstand any more of this for much longer. Hold on, Michael. Let's not declare her done just yet. Yeah, not to mention, these Divas have been very evenly matched so far. We're looking at complete domination here. Asuka is just too fast there. She is quick. It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. Stay down. Stay down. Oscar getting ready here. Sasha Banks looks like she's really struggling right now. She's able to break out of it. And it's Oscar that sees it coming. The traditional Survivor Series elimination tag team match is such a wild card, especially when you bring together so many combustible elements. She's clearly not shy about proving her dominance. Wait a minute, she's going for it again. Oh, that's it, that's gotta be it. Sasha Banks, now that's a finishing move, people. Dude, this is insane. I don't believe it, this one's over. execution of that win, I'd say. Few things are more rewarding than the feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. Simply amazing how well these three work together tonight. out from this tornado tag match. Oh man, a tornado tag match. So much drama surrounding this dangerous tornado tag team match.
Well, hopefully you have a cellar in your house at home because we have an F5 of a tornado tag match coming your way. Yeah, this should test the walls of this arena. Well, if you've never seen a tornado tag team match, get yourself ready for absolute mayhem because that's exactly what this is going to be. This tag team seems solid, but Tornado Tag Matches can break even the best of tag teams. Yeah, it puts your team to the test. So much drama surrounding this dangerous Tornado Tag Team Match. At a combined weight of 470 pounds, Kevin Styles and the Viper, Randy Orton, United States, the Brain Busters. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 417 pounds, they are the Xavier Woods, Extreme Television Ultraviolent Tag Team and Kofi Kingston. The New Day. Uh, we are seconds away from the start of this title match. Xavier Woods is looking for a new dawn while ending the day of his WWE foe here. There's no question that this one's going to be a struggle. An outright battle of wills. Times like these, I wish I had two heads and four eyes so I don't miss any of the action. Oh, and another thing, one competitor is risking the title and another is looking to claim it. Oh, this couldn't be better. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. I think you're right, Cole. This should be good. And uh-oh, looking at Randy Orton. What's the story for him right now? Orton's going into that almost psychotic state that he can turn himself into. Well, Michael, he's a third-generation superstar. His family's been in the industry for nearly 100 years. Being aggressive like this, it's in his blood. Oh, 
out to the outside he goes, where anything can happen and usually does. Yeah, and usually happens to our announce table. You better move your crown, King. <gasps> oh, and did you hear the impact? Kofi's one of the most dynamic athletes in WWE. His athleticism knows no bounds, and neither does his vertical leap. Kingston's sonic boom type of offense is so amazing that he's been given the nickname the Wildcat. And we all know Wildcats are fearless. He's starting to feel it here. At this point, it's all about how he responds and potentially rebounds. Going for the quick cover is Randy Orton. Two. Well, we get to see a lot of amazing things from where we sit. And believe me, when I say there is nothing like seeing Kofi Kingston's athleticism in the ring. Everyone loves it. Well, everyone except Kofi's opponents. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. You know, I'm not so sure outside is where you want to be. This floor is not very forgiving. Forgiving? Those mats don't cover up this concrete. No, cut off at the last second. From the top! To take a chance like that, do you know how badly he must want to win this? He is slowly getting dissected. Very, very painful hold here. What's he going to do? This is such a painful hold. Watch it. And he powers out. Kobe Kingston looks to be in some pretty bad Kobe Kingston's endured unspeakable punishment in this match. Positive thinking or not, he's got to be injured. Yeah, Kofi has significantly slowed down here. I don't know if it's all those blows that will prevent him from launching this famous aerial attack, but I wouldn't be surprised if it does. He's showing no signs of letting up. He's not looking like himself here. He may have to start reevaluating his game plan. That's true. And after already using his finisher once, he's probably wondering what he has to do to win this thing. Yeah, well, at this point, he may want to think about finding a way to take a breather. And here comes Xavier Woods. He's just brutalizing his opponent with that table. He's starting to feel it here. The Tornado Tag Team atmosphere appears to be getting the best of him here. And at this point, it looks to me like this match is as even as it could get. Well, that's a good point. And I must say that I'm a little surprised his finisher was so ineffective earlier. Looking for all the glory here. Oh, this guy's a competitor. He's not going down yet. Yeah, not without a fight anyway. Oh, there is no quit in this man tonight. That's it. He's done. Oh, man. There's the finisher. This could be it. You better believe he's seen scarier things than that. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. struggling a bit here. He needs to create some space for himself. He wants to be... Ah! Looking at it here. I think this is it. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. Xavier Woods is all about getting it done right here, people. And he gets out of the ring, stopping this assault for the moment. A textbook reversal. Can he follow? Look at the attack here. Oh, man, what a move. Jeez, after that one, he definitely has to muster up a comeback. He's in full-on attack. It's over. That's got to be it. This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. What a beating. Hi, right, guys. What a display. Inside the ring now. Just getting worn out. With a 180, Kofi Kingston, the reversal. Let me remind everybody, there are no count outs. These competitors can stay out here as long as they like. Randy Orton, 
no problem in getting out of that one. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. That's it. He's out. He's really done a number on him thanks to moves like that. Look out! He's spending more time outside the ring than in it. Great reversal. Uh-oh. Things could get real interesting out here. It's always in. Oh, and did you hear the impact? He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. The Xavier Woods looks like he's down and out. And believe me, this is not where he wants to be. Another vicious shot with that foreign object. What an attack. Take it from me, there's never a good place or a good time to get hit. WWE's not like other sports where you call a timeout after a major hit. The match goes on. I'll be shocked if that's not it. Yeah, and he's not looking too good now. Look at this. Here he comes. He's not done yet. Oh, no, he's here to fight. He's in full-on attack mode now. Boy, did he get dropped or what? Oh, he's in trouble now. Look at Xavier Woods getting ready here, people. Man, there's no getting up from that. It's just getting dissected. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Wow, he's still down after that. What a counter that was. He thinks he has it. He is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading it. And I think it's obvious that he'll stop at nothing to win here tonight. I don't think there's any lengths that these superstars won't go to to achieve victory here tonight. Good Lord, he's just hell-bent on maiming his opponent. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Oh, we got a cover. One. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. He's showing the heart of a warrior here tonight. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He wants no part of the outside. Well, I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. Throwing him 
defeating this champion will be no easy task. I assure you that. Will and Yvette, these two have absolutely no plans on spending Thanksgiving dinner together at any point in the near future. I hate Thanksgiving. Introducing the challenger from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing in at 204 pounds, Tyson Kidd. Introducing the champion from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, he is the Intercontinental Champion, the phenomenal AJ Styles. So much anticipation, and it all comes down to this. Thank you for choosing to spend your evening with us. I'm Michael Cole alongside, as always, Jerry the King Lawler. And I can't think of another place I'd rather be, Michael. This one's going to be great. Tell us about AJ Styles. What can we expect from him in this championship match? That's a proud champion, Michael, for sure. But there's also a hungry challenger in that ring, and I have no idea which way this one's going to go. Well, now that we're underway, it should start to become clear on what he plans to do to win this thing. Tyson Kidd's speed, agility, and submission expertise certainly makes him one of the most versatile superstars in WWE. And for opponents, one of the most dangerous. He's as comfortable flying off the top rope as he is grinding an opponent's face down into the mat. Here we go, back inside the ring. You know, there are a truckload of fundamentals that Tyson learned in the Hart Dungeon and under the tutelage of Owen and Bret Hart, but Tyson has taken those teachings and brought his abilities to a whole other level. Challenger's taking on some offense. He's gonna have to find a way to fend off the champ here. And at this point, it looks to me like this match is as even as it could get. 
It's a good point, John. And I'd say this match is about as even as it could get at this point. Now momentum is in the corner of AJ Styles. AJ Styles is fired up in this one. Look at the look in his eyes. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. Whoa! Whoa! And Tyson Kidd makes him pay for all that. There's the finishing move. Don't know if you have anything left after that. The toll from this match is really starting to show. Listen, it's a heck of a time to compete for a championship, but that's just the beginning if you want to wear the gold. A bad place to be for the challenger. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. You got that right, Michael. This is where we find out exactly what this guy's made of. You know what? He knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hold. That match could have gone on a little longer. exciting matches in recent Survivor Series history.
so much anticipation, and it all comes down to this. Divas beware, Nikki Bella has that trademark Bella speed, intelligence, and fire. Nikki also has a physical power that makes it possible for her to put a beating on Divas of all shapes and sizes. Since she's a Bella, you know she uses all of her assets to her advantage. Oh boy, the feeling in this arena is unbelievable. I'm not sure who's gonna win, but I am sure that we're gonna see a great match. Two superstars going head to head, I love it. But regardless, this is just another in a long line of awesome WWE sports entertainment. I wonder what Bailey is thinking about at this point in the match. As the challenger, what does she need to do to win this thing? I've got a good feeling about her, Michael. I think she might have what it takes to take down the champ. We shall see. You know, since day one here in WWE, Nikki Bella has proved she is way more than a pretty face. Nikki has great agility from her days playing soccer for fast ground and air attacks. And she's not afraid to fight fire with fire. And she's definitely the power member of the Bellas. I've said it before, and I'll happily say it again. Nikki Bella has it all. I mean, the stunning beauty, the intelligence, speed, and toughness. The term Total Diva is much more than just the name of a hit reality show. The challenger is starting to slow down a bit here. There's so much on the line for her here tonight. Let me interject this. When you have two Divas as evenly matched as these two are, there's no way to predict what's going to happen. Yeah, and these women are so evenly matched. I don't think either one has proven their dominance yet. She is really putting her stamp on this match now. Nikki Beck, yet another one for the highlight reel. Oh, man, there's the finisher. This could be it. All right, so she took a little misstep. Come on, put that down. It's nothing to record with your phone or anything. And Bailey makes her pay for all that. Are you kidding? This is nothing compared. Looking to steal in there, perhaps. Yeah, I think it's way too early in the match for that to work. Nikki Bella doing a great job of turning that around. Into the cover goes Nikki. There's not a person in this arena who thought that was it for him. No, this guy's too strong. This guy's too powerful. Turning it around, it's Bailey with the reversal. Nikki Bella doing a great job of turning that one around. Oh, what a counter by lovely Nikki. And that shot was dialed in. The champ just one step quicker. She's starting to stammer here. Momentum clearly not on her side. Look at this. This could do it. Maybe. Dude, she's not done yet. And I'm glad. I want this match to go a long time. It looks like there's some more fight left in this diva. Bailey is able to get out of danger. And that was dangerous. She is on an absolute tear right now. Look at Bailey making her moves. Oh, Bailey! Bailey! Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This might be it. Hot damn, it's exciting. Wait a minute, she's going for it again. And Bailey makes her pay for all that. There's the finishing move. Don't look. Hey, she's got some fight left in her still. Yeah, she's going strong. She just does not know the word quit. She looks unbeatable tonight. Oh, what a counter by lovely Nikki. 
This is incredible. Oh, my. What a move by Nikki Bella. That's got to be it. I'm telling you, Nikki just getting better and better with each passing week. Uh-oh. There's the finisher. This might be over. And I mean all over. The toll from this match is really starting to show. It's a big fight feel here in this arena. The WWE Universe hanging on every move. You're right, Cole. It's electric here. The WWE Universe is loving this match. What a counter. Nikki's in trouble. Oh, she can win it here. Maybe. One, two, and the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. Folks, we are witnessing intestinal fortitude at its highest level. There doesn't seem to be any slowing her down now. The champ counters, and you see the result. by Bailey. Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. Oh, no! Talk about getting launched out of the ring. And it appears Bailey is starting to hit the wall physically now. Bailey is in a world of hurt, people. Oh, turn out the lights. This one's just about it. Oh, resounding move by Nikki Bella. Look at her opponents in such bad shape. She might start screaming for help. Oh no! Try to put her away. There's no recovery from that. This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. What a beating. My gosh, what a display. The champ, just one step quicker. She appears to be extra slow regaining her base. Look at those eyes. Oh, yeah, this could be big. Nikki. Wow, what a move from Nikki Bella. Now, that's how you sweep an opponent under the carpet. And her opponent's in what you call a... Here we go for the win. I think they got him. Two. Three. And you can put this singles match in the books. Survivor Series match for the ages.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the NXT World Championship. Well, these two will have to put their friendship aside for one night, but I don't anticipate either one having an issue with that. I'm really looking forward to this one. So much on the line in this championship match. Singles action on the way. I've been waiting for this to get started. Here we go. The challenger has a lot to prove here tonight. And I assure you, the champion has no plans on getting knocked off. What champion comes in here planning on getting knocked off? Introducing the challenger from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 180 pounds, Hideo Atami. Introducing the champion from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, he is the NXT World Champion. Uh, we are seconds away from the start of this title match.
And here's Hideo Itami, folks, the man from Tokyo, looking to cause more damage. And Michael, with the championship on the line, you know these guys are going to do whatever it takes to leave here with it. Let's talk more action. Let's go. But here's the thing. You have to perform if you want to bask in that WWE glory. Guys, let's quickly discuss the champion. Doesn't get any bigger. What can we expect from the champ here? As defending champion, Finn Balor is at the top of his game. We'll have to see how long he can stay there. Success in this business never seems to last. Well, earlier backstage, the champ seemed very confident that tonight would be yet another success. A legend in his homeland of Japan, Hideo Itami brings to the States more than a decade and a half of in-ring experience. Yeah, and it was in Japan where Hideo Itami developed that sneaky, hard-hitting style of his. You really wouldn't expect somebody of his size to pack such a punch. That hard-hitting style we talked about earlier definitely comes from Hideo Itami's years spent training in the no-nonsense Japanese dojos. Yeah. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. And Hideo Itami reverses it. Cole, you know, I've been to Japan, and you're exactly right. Those dojos are no nonsense. Yep, there's the reversal by Finn Balor. He's in full-on attack mode now. position. That's it. He's out. Man, this is brutal. He needs to reorganize his thoughts after that one. Today, Tommy may be running out of gas here. The number one contender is close to letting this one get out of control. Hard to argue with that. Momentum certainly is not on his side. Well, victory's not the only thing on the line here, Cole. When you have a competitor such as this in the ring, pride becomes a major issue. Hideo Itami reversing it. Incredible. <laughs> hoping to end it early. Here's hoping. He's got plenty of gas left in his tank. You're right. He kicked out with ease. stops tonight. What great action we've had in this match. I'm absolutely loving it, Cole. Come on, aren't you? Look how excited you are. Yeah. 
shoulders down. Is it enough? This may be it. And the shoulders up now. That's a kick out. Nice. What do you have to do to keep this guy down? Oh, and a terrific reversal by Finn Balor. And he reversed it. Good move there. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. This guy's just getting worn out. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. Look at Finn Balor making his moves. Oh, incredible move by Hideo Itami. He's really letting his opponent have it. Oh, man. Hideo Itami looking absolutely... Here's the pin. Title on the line. And that title... And the shoulders come up after that pinfall attempt. You can't teach heart. Believe me when I tell you this guy is filled with it. Look at this. This could do it. Maybe. One. I don't know how much more damage he can take. And he reversed it. Good move there. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. We've seen this before. Finn Balor hits the jackpot with a huge move. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. The champ to the top turnbuckle. What's he got in mind? Finn Balor is in position. He's showing no signs of letting up. Yeah. Nice reversal. He's looking to put his opponent away on right here. He's endured heavy blows here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match. Wow. It doesn't get much better than that right there. Oh, man. There's the finisher. This could be it. Oh, man. I think he needs to regroup after that. Not this. He's looking at it again. Oh, a huge move by Hideo Itami. Uh-oh. Sure, this might be over, and I mean all over. He's just getting dissected. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. For the pin and the win. Two. No way. What a kick out. How did that happen? <laughs> My gosh, this guy has amazing resilience. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. I always find it interesting to see how these teams interact. There are so many unique personalities, and oftentimes they don't necessarily mesh well. How much more? How much more are you willing to pay to win this match? This is unreal. What? Does he have his eyes open? Oh, his body has to be broken right now. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Ooh, one of the most effective moves in all of WWE. He's really done a number on him thanks to moves like that. Okay, he's out. He kicked out. He kicked out. I can't believe it. Oh, my gosh. I'm in shock. Oh, there is no quit in this man tonight. He sees it. I think he's through playing around. Quickly into the cover with a title on the line. Here we go. What a way to win a 
singles match. champion unbelievable and on top of that there's a new champion in the wwe another amazing match in the long and story the following contest is scheduled for one fall and it is for the united states championship If you're just joining us, we are just about set for singles action. Why would you just be joining us now? Where have you been? Which one of these two will walk away with a win? We'll find out as this one gets underway in mere moments. Singles action on the way. I've been waiting for this to get started. Here we go. What an electric atmosphere we have here tonight for Survivor Series. Introducing the challenger from Maryville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Introducing the champion from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 200. 
120 pounds, he is the United States Champion, Kevin Styles. Oh boy, look at the gold. This should be an outstanding match. And here he is, the former NXT and WWE Intercontinental Champion, Kevin Owens. Let's see what he's got. Oh, you're right. And there's nothing like a little WWE mano a mano to get that blood flowing. Both these superstars are primed and ready to roll. Well, I know one thing, guys. When Kevin Owens steps in, a power bomb could be unleashed at any time. So look out! Let's talk about the challenger for a moment. Well, it's never easy to take down a champ. What kind of attack should he mount? There are moments in a superstar's life that he will remember forever. Four. For Kevin Owens, our challenger, this is one such moment. We'll see if he can seize the moment and the title, or if he fails like so many before him. I agree. Each one of these guys know what they need to do. It's just a matter of which one of them can get it done. You have to respect that Kevin Owens knows what he wants and goes right after it. He's one of the most no-nonsense competitors we've seen in a long time. Yeah, but I'm not so sure Sami Zayn respects that. Kevin Owens wanted Zayn's NXT title and cut to the front of the line in February. Here's a cover. something in his eye. The champ to the top turnbuckle. What's he got in mind? You'd have to think that Kevin Owens' brawling style makes him incredibly difficult to game plan for. Putting it all on the line. That's the way it should be. how slow he is to react right now. <laughs> look, look! There's no recovering from that. Oh, trust me, he's, he's seen much worse. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. To your earlier point, Cole, there's no game planning for a guy who's going to come right at you like Owens does. The only thing I can think of is maybe run. <laughs> nice reversal there. And he rolls out, buying himself some breathing room. Now back to the ring. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. Oh, geez. Knocked into next week. Perhaps feeling a little more comfortable on the outside at this point. Yeah, more comfortable outside the ring than inside. He was able to reverse that. Well, that missed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. What? It's got to be over now. Now that's what you call finishing a fight. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Look at Kevin Owens. It's coming. Well, that's it. Oh, good grief. Great counter. The champ just one 
step quicker. When he gets going like this, oh, nice counter. Kevin Owens on the offensive. some of the pain that's been dished out and find a way to forge on. A quick pin. Can he do it? Maybe. There goes KO with the mind games. Nobody does it better than Kevin Owens. If he wasn't already in a match, I'd say he was trying to start a fight. I totally agree with you. Nobody controls incredible counter. Oh, Kevin Owens is in a tough situation here, folks. He put up a good fight, but it may be the end of the line for the challenger here tonight. And at this point, his opponent definitely has that finisher well scouted. Going for it a third time might be a mistake. Yep. He seemed to be in pretty bad shape right now, but I still think that's it. He's out. His foe's in a world of hurt now. Good grief. Quickly into the cover with the title on the line. Here we go. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't fill up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. This match has taken so much out of this guy, he's not going to give up. But man, this has been physical. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there. But only one can walk out victorious. <laughs> That's it. He's done. This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. What a beating. What a move. This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. I don't believe it. This one's over. Should be no doubt in anyone's mind that he's the true and deserving champion. Absolutely. What an incredible match. Well, he just showed what being a champion is all about.
This match has chaos written all over it. That's what I love about it. I love chaos. Oh, uh, there's been many great matches over the years on Thanksgiving, and this one will surely live up to the tradition.
And there's the bell. Time to see if Bray Wyatt can still eat worlds or if he's going to be the one who gets devoured. Well, there's an awful lot of flesh and muscle inside that ring in this six-man competition. I can't believe I get paid for this. Well, me either. But hey, by the sounds of it, this crowd is ready for anything that happens tonight. It takes a great deal of ability to plot out what you're going to do in a contest such as this one. What direction do you think he's going to go here? When you have two quality partners by your side, you have a tendency to walk with a little bit of a swagger. I think that's what we're seeing here. You know, this is the type of contest where he really needs all he's got to make sure you don't suffer pain from this match long after it's over. I'm not sure if I've ever experienced an eerie silence that falls over an entire arena like I do when Bray Wyatt announces he's here. Even in darkness, you can see the whites of people's eyes and the audience fixated on Bray Wyatt and frightened beyond explanation at what he's going to do. a bit off his game here to be expected when you come Eric Rowan looking to finish this one early Zayn starting to struggle. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Yeah, well at this point, he may want to think about finding a way to take a breather.
He's not looking like himself here. We all know, though, this guy has plenty of fight left in him. I tell you, we knew this was going to be a close affair, but I don't think we expected it to be this tight. What a match. Well, it's hard to argue that, but I'd say this one could go either way. slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. Eric Rowan, no problem getting out of that one. Ambrose is starting to struggle now. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Oh, it's been a great match up to this point, and this could really go either way. <laughs> Ambrose starting to struggle now. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. And Michael, this might very well be where one of these guys pulls away from the other. Well, it's hard to argue that. Into a quick cover is Dean Ambrose. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Great reversal. A reversal from Ambrose. Oh, that was slick. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. Uh-oh, what is Dean Ambrose going to do here? Takes to the air! Dean Ambrose delivering crippling punishment. There's the finishing move. Don't know if you have anything left after that. The toll from this match is really starting to show. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. You know, I've been in a lot of arenas, and I've seen a lot of things, but I've never seen a capacity crowd stand with such a combination of fear and awe as when Bray Wyatt begins his ominous walk to the ring. one outside the ring because he's a pro king he wants to get it done inside Bray Wyatt on the defensive but we all know that he isn't afraid of a good fight which is what we're seeing here it looks like his toughness is about to be tested I don't disagree and one thing I'll never do is count this guy out nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy I think you can tell by looking into the disturbing eyes of Bray Wyatt that he likes this this man enjoys knowing that when he walks into an arena People are frightened of him more with each horrifying step he takes. If that doesn't tell you what you need to know about Bray Wyatt, then I don't know what you are. Oh my God, I think now people everywhere realize what Bray Wyatt can do, and they all share that fear. That fear that he may enter the arena in their home city and carry out a massacre worse than what they previously saw. It's one thing to see it on television. It's another to witness it in person. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. You know, when you look at Bray Wyatt, he may not resemble your traditional WWE suit. He's looking for the win. This may be it. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. He wisely ducks out of the ring after that 
huge maneuver. I don't know if it was so wise. It was out of necessity. Bray Wyatt reverses it. And it's Dean Ambrose able to break free. Trying to get under his... With this kind of attack, you have to wonder just how much longer they... And Dean Ambrose going for it early with the cover. He is slowly getting dissected. Sami Zayn tags in. What makes Bray Wyatt so dangerous is that he actually has the athletic ability and physical strength to systematically dismantle someone exactly the way his ruthless mind tells him to. You talk about demented. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh no, here we go. Sami Zayn, oh, Bray Wyatt, Bray Wyatt, finisher. This match might be over. That phased him. I mean, there's no way it couldn't have. Sami Zayn has eyes to finish. Oh my, there's the submission hold. He's in the driver's seat now. This is such a painful hold. of human psychology and so his words are just as dangerous as his actions. Turning it around, it's Sami Zayn with the reversal. He gets out of trouble there. Nice reversal. Executing the reversal. What does Sami Zayn have to do at this point to stay in this match? He came into this match looking for a fight, and it looks like he found one. Well, these guys have been so tightly matched up until now, but this might be where that finally starts to change. I don't know about you guys, but I find it a little alarming that we're going to have to And now Bray Wyatt could have this match in the bag. What a finishing maneuver. This could do it. Maybe it. The traditional Survivor Series elimination tag team match is such a wild card, especially when you bring together so many combustible elements. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Oh no, here we go. Sami Zayn sees it. Sami Zayn smashes that one. Oh man, there's the finisher. This could be it. I can't believe what I just saw. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you just want to counter that once. And oh my God, his body's been through hell and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. The body's taking some abuse here, but nothing that can't be shaken off. This one's not over yet. We've seen plenty of people come back from being in a lot worse shape. Nice counter by Ziggler. Yeah, he may be a show off, but he's such an amazing natural athlete as well. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Don Ziggler is going in for the kill. figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too. I've given up even trying to figure out what they're going to do next. I'm just sitting back watching and enjoying. Go free. Yeah, and he's not looking too good now. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Look at this one. Wyatt is 
just so sneaky. Yeah. White is so dangerous on so many different levels. In my opinion, Dolph Ziggler has got to get back into this. What are your thoughts? He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. Well, this might finally be where one of these guys starts to pull away. The perseverance he's shown so far tonight is truly admirable. I get the feeling it's going to be incredibly tough to put him away. Yeah, real tough. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. They're not holding anything back. And I like it. Historically, Thanksgiving has been a big night in the sports entertainment world, and I expect tonight to be no different. fans watching this match all around the world. We want to say hi to them, all the countries, even Manila, where I use their envelopes. Manila's not a country. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. What an all-star ensemble in the ring right now. Six of WWE's most successful competitors for sure. Eric Maneuver. Oh, there it is. He thinks he has it. Whoa, whoa! Dolph Ziggler getting trounced here. And I'm not sure he even knows where he is. And Michael, he clearly loves using his finisher. It's just too bad it hasn't actually finished anything for him here tonight. Well, he's not looking very good right now, but I'm not quite ready to say that this one's over yet. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. And the ref sees the tag. Oh, he missed. Oh, nobody home that time. All respect given. It looks like Dean Ambrose can be done for. You can't help but wonder how much more of this he can take. At this point, it's hard to say one of these guys is in bed. His shoulders are down. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. What's he going to do here? What's he going to do here? And there's the reversal. And Dean Ambrose manages to reverse out of that one. He saw that one coming. Look, Dean Ambrose. He looks like he's got this. Incredible move by Dean Ambrose. I can't believe he can still go like that. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. He's begging for it. Dean Ambrose has his eyes on his target, folks. Perhaps Dean Ambrose has this match won now, people. He is just getting busted. He could pin his opponent right here. I think this is it. And there goes the superstar. Luke Harper visibly losing steam. He doesn't want to let this match get out of control, guys. 
Oh, don't worry about him, Mago. He definitely seems to have more gas in the tank than his opponent. Good point, but I'd still say that he's in the driver's seat. Oh, reversal! Oh, two! You can just see it in his eyes. Ambrose is psychotic. Three. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. He gets out of trouble there. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't throw up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. He anticipated that move perfectly. Tough spot to be in for Dean Ambrose. Oh, he looks like he's in no man's land here. He needs to be able to put things back together here. Michael, this is a dangerous position to be in. He needs to be able to find a way to clear the cobwebs and regroup. Six of WWE's most alpha personalities all competing in the same match. There's a good chance this one ends deteriorating sooner than later. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Luke Harper is on a roll right now and gaining lots of ground. That's got to be it. Luke Harper. How about that finishing move? This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. What a beating. I think it's gut check time now. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. And here comes Luke Harper. Whoa, Luke Harper hit that one. Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This, there's the cover. Can he do it? I think he's got him. Two. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. A reversal for Ambrose. Oh, that was slick. for the win. Let's do this. Two. Luke Harper gets out of that one. Nice moves. And there's the submission. Can he fight out? It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time. You're not going to win many matches absorbing punishment like that. Oh, this isn't good. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be tank. But I still don't see him giving up. Oh, Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt. Man, oh man. He can do it here. I think he's got it. this match. 
catch in the bag. This it will it be? I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. They roll out of the ring, hoping to recover here. Yeah, if they didn't get out of the ring, it would be over right now. And he rolls out, buying himself some breathing room. Wow, I cannot believe Dean Ambrose got out of that one. Got a lot of spring left in his step right now. One, two. Historically, Thanksgiving has been a big night in the sports entertainment world, and I expect tonight to be no different. He whipped that one. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't fill up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. Seems like these guys are letting out a lot of pent-up frustration tonight. Few superstars are as dominant as this. He thinks he has it. We're so excited you chose to spend your Sunday with us. everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. What a collision. Good grief. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. And he goes for the cover. This is it. Embarrassing events of 1994 when the entire team of Shawn Michaels, Diesel, Jeff Jarrett, and Hart and Jim Neidhart were eliminated all at the same time. Extra slow getting back to his base here. He's making a statement here with this attack.
He took the move by Dean Ambrose. He's really done a number on him thanks to moves like that. How much more? How much more are you willing to pay to win this match? This is unreal. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He gets out of trouble there. successful competitors for sure. Nice dodge there. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Uh-oh. Big move coming. Few superstars. Incredible counter. Boy, he was able to reverse it. Get out of that. Here we go for the win. I think they got two. He just didn't have enough left to hang on. And there's the tag. Luke Harper into the ring. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempted at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. Yep, there's the reversal by Luke Harper. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. You're right about that. Oh, my. What a move. Gosh, what a battle. You have to continue the assault against someone like... Here he goes for the win. Let's do this. That's one less superstar to deal with. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. one person could take. I don't care how tough you are. Four. I always find it interesting to see how these teams interact. There are so many unique personalities and oftentimes they don't necessarily mesh well. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Where why they get this, folks? Oh, lights out! What a finishing move. He could pin his opponent right here. I think this is it. You're not going to win many matches absorbing punishment like that. Here we go. Bray Wyatt setting it up. Ray Wyatt makes him pay for all that. Now that's a finishing move. This thing might be all over. This match has been awesome. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. This could do it. Maybe it. Two. He just eliminated him with authority. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hit of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you got to jump on it. Arnie missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The breeze may give him a cold. There's the pin. Pin is upon a kick out. Two. He 
He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Sami Zayn has eyes to finish. No way. What a move from Sami Zayn. That's how you impress the WWE Universe, folks. And the pitfall gets him the win. Underway, and if this arena has any indication, it's going to be one for the record book. Uh, they've been waiting a long time for this match. We've seen some huge title defenses in recent years, and I'd say this one ranks right up there. There's a reason why this guy's the champ, and I think he's about to show us what that reason is. Ladies and gentlemen, you're looking at one of the greatest champions WWE has seen in a very long time. I'm in shock. I can't believe you're not talking about yourself.
Introducing the challenger from Aberdeen, Washington. Weighing in at 210 pounds, Daniel Bryan. Introducing the champion from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Weighing in at 238 pounds, he is the Triple Crown Champion. The best, Sonia Mann! So much anticipation, and it all comes down to this. There's no other way to put it. This one-on-one -on -one match is going to be a struggle in every sense of the word. Neither man looks like they are remotely entertaining the idea of backing down. This is gonna be good. Well, in these head-to-head -head matchups, you've got no one to rely on but yourself. And that's the way it should be. Mono a mono, one fall will decide it. Regardless, Daniel Bryan looks active early, and that's a good sign for him and for his fans. As the action progresses, let's briefly talk about the champion. The champ has been here before. What do you expect from him in his title defense? It can be lonely at the top. Everybody in that locker room is gunning for you, and he don't know who you can trust. No doubt about it, the champion has earned everything. Time will tell if the challenger can usurp the throne. You know, for a performer who's earned a reputation as being a vegetarian superstar, it's pretty ironic that one of Daniel Bryan's best finishing moves is the cattle mutilation. But let me tell you, Daniel uses that hold to devastating effect. I've seen him bend opponents in half with it. He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Yeah, I wonder what the view's like from up there. Oh, he hard no mistake there. You know, the pressure the cattle mutilation finisher puts on the shoulder blades is absolutely incredible. Daniel will fold you up like a taco shell. Your shoulders are just practically touching each other, and the pain just becomes too much to bear. The cattle mutilation's a merciless hold. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Champ counters, and you see the result. He's obviously making fun of his opponent here. The nerve of this guy. Very, very painful hold here. What's he gonna do? What an inspirational success story Daniel Bryan has been coming up the hard way over 10 years on the indie circuits in wrestling. He knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hold. Whoa! And he fights his way out. He sees it. Daniel Bryan is just so dangerous. This match has swayed his way very quickly here. Whoa, look out. He's trying to turn this around. And it has to be said that the success Daniel Bryan's enjoyed in WWE. Daniel Bryan is getting on a nice roll right here. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Great counter. The champ just one step quicker. And down he goes. Oh, and he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, 
You're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Look at this guy. Daniel Bryan's in there, and I wish I could just go in the ring and say it right to his face. Another amazing singles time, and that was a huge counter. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? I can't wait to see what Brian does here. Uh oh, he's in position, ready to strike. Oh, Daniel, looking for the submission. The champ on the defensive now. He's endured heavy blows here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match, King. Oh, my gosh, this is awful. I'm going to tell you something. Whenever you get hit like that, for the next 15 minutes, everybody you see has an exact win. Is Daniel Bryan going to be able to recover from that? I don't like the look of this, Cole. Bad things happen outside the ring. I just can't get over the physicality of this match. This has been brutal. Brutal and very, very painful for these guys. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. Yeah. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Two, three, wow, Daniel Bryan timed that perfectly. Three, he doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Six. The Seven. official continuing his count toward 10. Back in the ring now. <laughs> well, that, that's it. Wow, now that's what you call a finisher. This There's the pan. Ken is upon a kick out. Two, three. This singles match has come to an end. Wow. going on here out of the ring now what's gonna happen <laughs> get in there and handle business reminds me of myself in my younger days he's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here good grief oh no we could be seeing the end of the yes movement. Ah. Oh, slaps him with the ribs. He may have broken his ribs. Oh, did you see that? I have a funny feeling that this is going to turn into a whooping. What a move. This is insane. Does this building have a curfew? I feel like we might be here all night. What a beating. Oh, wow.